how to manipulate strings in uh, your shell in your terminal without using any additional programs. Today at work we were setting up uh, CI and we were getting branch name that was looking somewhat like this feature slash new header. We wanted to use only the last part so the domain would look like new header some domain dot com or something turns out in bash or any other shell you can actually remove uh, the first part and leave only the last one without using any additional programs there is special syntax to do it that i'm gonna show in a second first let's save our branch name uh, to a variable branch name equals double backtick git branch show current Let's check if it works. Echo, branch name. Okay, now let's remove the feature part. To do this, I'm gonna use echo to output the result. I use dollar sign curly braces, and inside of it, I use branch name. It's our variable name, sharp feature slash. And we have new header without the feature part. Now what if I don't want to remove the feature part and instead I want to replace slash with the dash so I still can use it as part of the subdomain. This syntax will look a little bit awkward because we are removing uh, slash and we will need to screen it. But let's do it. Echo dollar sign curly braces branch name slash now we screen with slash our slash and another slash to separate from the string we are going to use to replace our slash with dash and we are done we got feature dash new dash header honestly i was very surprised that there is such functionality because i was expecting that i will have to use some sort of sad or awk or uh, other unix monstrosity sort of editor but turns out there is base built-in functionality inside shell itself that you can use to manipulate strings oh another example we were removing prefix uh, the word in the beginning of our string what if we want to remove suffix something that is in the end of our string let's say we want to remove new header from our branch name so we leave only the feature then we use then we use percentage sign instead of sharp and we write slash new header And we get only the feature. There is a lot more cool uh, things you can do just using pure uh, shell syntax that I found in advanced bash scripting guide. So I totally recommend reading this book. It is full of useful examples and starts with uh, complete basics like the very beginning of how to write shell scripts and actually covers uh, pretty much everything you might need working with uh, shell. So I'm definitely going to spend some of my time reading this book. Now thank you for watching this video, I will leave a link for the book in the description, press like button if you like this tip and uh, see you in the next videos.